and how did you get involved in the program? My name is Amy Braverman. I'm a teacher at Alexander, and this is my second year. I started when the program began. We came with teachers last summer, and um, I've taken, this is my third group of students to take on the boat. research a little bit with water quality. And what degree are you going for? A uh, master's in environmental studies. So I'm placed at Alexander with Mrs. Braverman. So I work in her classroom a couple days a week during the school year and then we get to come out here twice a year. Uh, okay. testing water. Seven. 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 Okay, so you're going to write seven. Shane, Michael. And what brought you here today? Uh, biology class. You think you might become a biologist? Maybe. I'm well, Mr. Beard. Call me Mark. <laughs> what we're going to do today, you were up front and you did the dipsticks doing a screening method for pH, um, nitrate, and phosphate. Uh, this is more of a very specific chemical test rather than the screening. Okay, so the scientist has to wear the official scientist coat. Okay, what we're going to do is just get a little bit, it's called an aliquot, when you get a little bit, we don't care how much, and I'll pour it in here. So we have, that's about all we need for this. Sometimes we can use this filter and we will look at the filter, checking out the plankton, the algae, we can see what's in the river. Okay, so this thing's draining and the water is going through, but it's filtering it. It's right. Thing, right, exactly, it's filtering it. And that's in this thing right here? Yes. Shop. That's all I'll take the Wipe blank vial clean and place in cell. Close lid tightly. Okay, so our result is 2.75. And what's our units? Milliliter, milligrams. Milligrams per liter. There's always units. student one day? Hopefully. And what do you think you'll major in? Uh, engineering. Yeah. And then has today's trip uh, made you think about OU as a choice? 